What's up guys, today I'm gonna to show you how to update and re-sign Uncover without a computer, and I'm gonna be using Reprovision to do that. First things first, however, before we get into that, you are going to have to be jailbroken already to do this method. So it's important that you jailbreak. Go ahead, go down below in the description, check out my jailbreak tutorial. You can go over there and you can jailbreak, and once you're done that, then you're ready to watch this video. So you can see right here, the Uncover version I'm on is 4.1.1. So today I'm gonna to show you how to get a later version in this video. And if your app is already revoked and you wanna know how to go and sign it again and get it to actually work on device, all you have to do is go down below in the description and it'll appear on screen now, add the source on the screen and then type in reprovision. And once you do that, you can install that package. And then from there, we can go in and do everything we need to do to do the rest of this video. One important thing that I forgot to mention is that in order for this to work, you do have to be in jailbreak mode. The reason for this is reprovision relies on a jailbreak mode in order to actually work and function. So if you're in a stock mode and you're there for maybe a week, two weeks, a month, whatever the case is, and you think because you set it up that it's just automatically re-signing it, it won't automatically re-sign an application if you're not in jailbreak mode. So you have to make sure that you're in jailbreak mode when you're doing this. And also in the future, if you want it to continuously re-sign on cover, you have to make sure that you are in jailbreak mode to get it to do that. Also, in order to use reprovision, you will have to sign in with your Apple ID. With all that out of the way, we're ready to get into the tutorial. So all you have to do is go to uncover.dev in Safari, and then you're just gonna click the download button. Once you do that, it's just going to download the .ipa, and once it downloads the IPA, you're going to see that appear in the downloads manager. You also, obviously, like I said, are going to have to be jailbroken already to do this process. So you can jailbreak through Alt Store with the tutorial that I did down below in the description. Whatever way works, as long as you get jailbroken, you can do the rest of this tutorial. So again, all we're gonna do is go to the Downloads Manager, and then we're gonna go to the IPA, and we're gonna hit the Share button, and once we do that, then you should see it says Copy to Reprovision. So once we see that, we're just gonna tap on it. Then it is going to open up inside of Reprovision. You could see there's an Install button, so we're gonna tap that, and also there is a version number, and it says 4.2.1, which as of this recording is the latest version of Uncover. So this is the latest, and Reprovision just gave us a message letting us know that it's successfully signed on cover. And now from here, if I go into on cover, you can see that we are on version 4.2.1. And now that I have my app updated, you would think that it should be as easy as just going into airplane mode. And then from there, hitting the jailbreak button when you're jailbroken. But you can see that that actually won't work. I can close out of Uncover and I can go back into it and hit the jailbreak button and it comes back with an error. So how do we go about fixing this? All we have to do is just close out of Uncover, volume up, volume down, side button, go and slide to power off the device if you're running iPhone 10 and above, obviously. And then from there, you can reboot the device and once it comes back up, then you should be able to jailbreak perfectly fine. So now we're back up at the lock screen and once we're here, we can just go and put our device in airplane mode, make sure it's there, and then we can open the Uncover app. Once we do that, all we have to do is just hit jailbreak and the reliability is good enough now in newer versions that it should work right off the bat. And then from there, you're jailbroken. Some people might still have some issues trying to get into jailbreak mode, but for the most part, reliability is a lot better than it was when the jailbreak first came out. You can see I'm in jailbreak mode with the latest Uncover version 4.2.1. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and turn that post notification bell on to never miss out on a brand new video. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'm gonna have a Top Tweaks video fairly soon. Have a good one, guys. Peace.